your last uh, English Classic sale purchase is maybe a, the, one of the steals of the sale. The Colt by Charge Forward, uh, the same sire as Response, who won a couple of group ones for the stable, of course. And you've done well with Menager Charge, Face Forward, Red Rain, all out of the same, all out of the same, st uh, same stallion. Yeah, um, very happy with him. Um, I think it's a really good sign. You know, he's a first foal and he's a cracking sort. And you know, I think that's a really good sign. Uh, I mean, the mayor can do a job like that. He's a, you know, he's a leggy, athletic sort of horse who, you know, whilst we think he'll go early, he'll train on and, um, you know, wrap to bring him home. Yeah, he's bred on the same across the charge forward Flying Spurs uh, headway, who it was a two-year-old group, group winner, then won a group one of three, that's what you're saying. Speak fondly, Cracker Roadie, uh, Road Trip, and they've all won stakes races. There's quite a few of those on that on that cross. Yeah, yeah. Um, it's a young, active family too, so, uh, you know, he, he's out of a half sister to she's clean and, um, you know, like I said, he ticked the boxes with me. Um, he's a leggy, athletic sort of horse who, you know, whilst he might get up and go early, he'll certainly train on and, you know, he's, he's probably built to be a, a three-year-old sort of horse. You mentioned that family's going so well. The, the Grand Dam Feather Dust is a half sister to uh, Kinshasa no Kasiki, who was an outstanding racehorse in Japan. So the quality's there all over the world in the, in the pedigree. Um, and really, you might have stolen on this one. Yeah, I think so, you know. He's, um, I don't know, with Charge Ford, he's probably not a great sail ring horse, but... Um, you know, for me, he, he was, you know, up there with, you know, probably the top sort of five or six colts at the sale and 70 grand, uh, you know, it was good buying. Well, he'll be one that we'll be able to see at the uh, Alan Zara Racing Open Day next Sunday, March the 5th. Uh, get along because the pedigrees are great and when you see them, the uh, you'll see that they're impressive types as well.